Right here, folks. Now, I'm not really sure where I'm trying to get to now. I seem to remember there's some sort of walkway that um, used to be the old railway line to the law or something. Uh, right behind me there we have Cox's stack, so I'm in the in the right area. I'm just following my nose, basically, so hopefully we'll end up where I'm supposed to be. Just found this uh, stone circle there, but that's a fake one. Alright, hopefully this walkway should be just up here somewhere. Just where the ivy is, Alex promising. Here we go. Alright, we're just heading down here now. Let's see where this takes us. Right, just as I came in here, there's a guy walking down and he shouts me, I've seen some of your videos. So whoever you are, mate, thank you very much indeed for taking the time to say hello. Now, this is the Miley Urban Wildlife Reserve. Let's see what this is all about. Right, I'll put all the blurb, I'll leave it there for Will Hobbs to look at because he likes all that, uh, all the history and the blurb that goes with all this stuff. So Will Hobbs, enjoy that. Yes, indeed. So here we go. Down to the, uh, the Miley Cyrus or whatever it's called. <laughs> all sorts of little paths leading off here, look. There we go. Oh, and there's a... Here we go, folks. There is a tunnel. So you know what that means. Oh, yes. There it is. Oh, it's a good one. So here we are then, we're in a tunnel. You know what's gonna happen, folks. Here we go. Speedies! Oh, that's a good one there, yes, we like that. Especially with the uh, the circular bit in it. That's what gives it the, the great acoustics in here. Awesome. Oh, someone's coming. So we're walking down a bit of history here, folks. This is where the uh, the first kind of railway in Dundee was built, the New Tile Railway, heading out into the countryside. Now, the only way for the folk off Dundee to get anywhere back in the, uh, the mid-1800s and the late 1800s was on foot or, of course, by, by the newly adapted train system. So they started work on this new tile uh, network. It's got a, a good heritage, a good heritage, yes, indeed. Um, we like going to new tile, and you can see where the terminus kind of ended. We'll go there another day and do another one off the railways. But uh, there's all bits and pieces left off the network as you head out towards uh, new tile and that kind of area. There's all these old bridges and uh, little tunnels and. Uh, sort of abandoned viaducts and things, yeah. So it's still here, but for how much longer I don't know. Because over there we've got an industrial estate, we're housing this side. It's all encroaching upon history, isn't it? And I give this another, well, another decade or something before it all disappears under the the engulfment of progress. Well, I didn't see any fungi yesterday, but a little bit of fungi here. It's a bit dead. Right. 
know, I've been walking for about 10, 20 minutes and I don't actually know where I am. I've just found a gap. There's been a fence here, so I wonder if this could be a, a way through. Oh, I appear to be in some sort of wilderness. Crikey, it's like I've stepped through Narnia. <laughs> wow. Right, okay. Uh, what's over that way? Where am I? I can see the B&Q sign over there. That's why I parked. Now, I could either continue all the way down there and see what's at the end, or I can just nip back up here, but I think I'll just carry on. been attacked by a wild beast. Excuse me, control your dog. Hello. Or as Bro would say, hello. <laughs> Crikey, that was a bit disconcerting. Big Alsatian coming charging towards you, slovering away. Crikey. Control your beast. I wonder how that woman would like it if I went running and charging at her. I'm sure she wouldn't like it. So, I mean, I'm not very fond of dogs, really. So, uh, I don't know if she would like it. Right, should we go up here? Another little pathway here. Let's see where this ends up. Crikey, the fence has been smashed down. Right. Oh, well, I guess it's quite steep. Crikey, I'm in a football ground. Goodness me, I think this is where Lockie Harp play. I didn't expect to come up here. Right, okay. I don't think I should be in here really, should I? Right, how do I get out of here? Yeah, let's go back down again. Alright, I've come to the end of the path. I can just see the car's just over there. But there's no way through, so I'm going to have to... Uh, go all the way around this piece of ground. I was over there in the Lockheed football ground. So I'll have to go all the way back around again and down into the Miley Cyrus and along and back up again or just find a new route. A new route. Right, well here's the gap in the fence that I originally came through. So now we're back. Back on the old new tile railway system. That's where I've just come from, and that's where we're going. Right, well, that was a bit of an unexpected detour there, folks. So, uh, but I think I know where I am now because it's going to come out at uh, where I was going to go, the um, the hobby shop and all the what's that retail park called? Kingsway Retail Park. I think that's what it's going to be. So I'm going to nip in there. And what I'm going to do, folks, is get some uh, beads with Jag written on it. Some letter beads. I'm going to make uh, some some uh, some bangles and things, you know. Plus, as I said, I need I need a thumb. All right, folks, I've sneaked through another hole in a fence. I've come into this other wasteland where there's a couple of um, mounds on it like this. So I don't know what it's... Or just a rubbish heap, or is it an ancient burial mound? Is this where the Picts buried all their Dundee dead? Who knows? It's quite, quite a substantial mound. There's another one over there. It's just waste grounds. I reckon it's just been a, a big slag heap. Basically, they just pile all the rubbish here and then just let it all grow over. So unfortunately, I don't think I am standing on the uh, the hill of lost, dead, picked kings. I think it's just rubbish. Probably rubbish from uh, the industrial era of Dundee. So yeah, I bet if you dug down here, you might find some good stuff, man. Security man came there to see what was going on. That's okay. Right, well, I've reached uh, the end off 
the remains of the railway, the Miley Urban Wildlife. That's the end of it. Good walk with a couple of detours. There we go. Will Hobbs, here it comes. Right, so I've emerged out onto the Cleppington Road, or as they call it in Dundee, the Cleppy. Just right at the very end of the Cleppy. Now over there is the Kingsway Retail Park. So I'm just going to nip in there. I do have my wallet, that's fine. Let's do this. Alrighty folks, well, I've just uh, popped in there to hobby craft. I got the things I needed and it's time to go home now. I can always tell when it's time to go home my shoulder starts getting sore. So we're just gonna get back to the car now. Home, chill. Thanks very much for watching as always folks. Always appreciate having you with me. It's always great when you come out and about with me. So until I've got a long, a long, a long, uh, a long, long, a long week at work, folks. I'm working next Sunday, so I'm working Tuesday, Wednesday, I'm off Wednesday night, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Good Lord, what a what a long one that's going to be, folks. Anyway, do join me for more further adventures in the life of Jack Lives. Until then, I'll see you sooner than you think. And a quick post script here to end uh, the afternoon. No scarves. I just cannot find my two silk scarves anywhere. The ones I got from the Glasgow shop, the red one and the blue and the, the red bead paste one. They must be at work, man. They've got to be at work. But I, oh, whoa.